the wheel and technology is going to make. Uh, we're going to be talking a little bit later about our newly introduced Dragon desktop platform. Um, we're going to show a demo right now that takes this capability another step forward and does some of this in real time. So Jules, let's talk about that. Well, that's a very good point, Kirk. I mean, we're really trying to get this to happen in the real time realm, which brings it into the space of video games and many other kinds of applications. Uh, but before we show our real time demo, I'd like to show one more clip of an actor on the light stage, and some of you may recognize him. Let's roll that clip and take a look. One of the problems with visual effects films is if you use the technology that exists at the time you begin the film, you're usually obsolete by the time you release the film. So you have to go into it making assumptions about what you're going to be able to invent. So this is going to take a minute, and once we do that, we'll just, we'll just get in sight for a second. John Dykstra was at the top of the business, so uh, as far as the effects, he got that. <laughs> so if you can just put that on in a way that will uh, not mark any of your mark. She's your queen! It's a sample of real life as opposed to recreating real life in a simulation. So that's why skin is so hard to do. 